Hey guys, coming at you with another video. This is my toy haul from the San Jose Toy Show here in California. I just want to show you guys what I picked up and tell you how much I paid for these guys. I think I got them at a good price. Um, first off, I want to show you <laughs> the one I already opened, um, the Scarlet Witch. I paid $22 for her. The guy was asking more, but I got him down to 22 and um, yeah, this one was, was a good find right here for twenty two bucks. You can't beat that. Um, I seen her go for higher prices like fifty and forty, but twenty two dollars, man. I don't know if the guy knew what he had or or what, but yeah, lucky for me. And I got the Deadpool here for twenty five. Um, I seen him range from thirty to forty, even fifty, but I got lucky and found him for twenty five dollars. And uh, closed mitten box, man. The Groot here. I know a lot of you are looking for this one, but got him at the toy show. Thirty dollars. I mean, I could not pass this up. I walked through the whole toy show. You know, they got tons of tables and vendors there, and everybody had them forty and up. The guy I got this from had it for thirty. So I looked through the whole thing. Went back. He had one left. He had two. Went back when I decided to buy him. He had one left. And I had to pick it up. 30 bucks. Not too bad. And this Captain America here from Civil War. I paid $15 for him. I don't have a movie version of Captain America. So I figured hey, 15 bucks ain't bad. And then you get the bill of figurehead here for Ant-Man. Not bad. He goes perfectly. I mean... With the Scarlet Witch here, and I have the Black Panther from Civil War, so um, I can start building my Civil War movie figures. And then I got Venom here and Silk from one vendor for twenty each, forty bucks right there. I I knew I know she was hard to get, so I got her for twenty, which is a very good deal. I've seen her for thirty and more at, at other places in the show, so when I saw her for twenty, I had to swoop her up for that price, especially him too. Um, I really like this one. I mean, the sculpt on her face is, like, really nice. A lot of detail, like, just looks different. I really like this one. i never seen her in the stores, so I saw her, I had to get her. I mean, that Groot has a, a really good sculpt, too. He's the same as the build figure from the first Guardians of the Galaxy wave. The first, first one that came out a couple, like, a year or two ago. I think two years. But um look at that sculpt work man. It's just amazing how they get down on these sculpts. And I also picked up um a Star Wars figure. Sabine. I picked her up for thirty dollars. And here she is. I, as soon as I got to the car, I opened her. She was the first one I opened. And then I opened the Scarlet Witch. She's really cool. I mean, I tried to get it lower. The price lowered like to 25 or something. But the guy wouldn't budge. Nobody would budge on these prices for this figure or Darth Revan. Um, Darth Revan was going for 40 and up. Nobody would budge on that price. If it had a price on it, that's the price you had to pay for it. So I didn't get him. I'll get him next time in, in the next show. The next one is in May. This is the date right here, the times, the address. Um, it's fun to go to. You find a lot of good deals. A lot of people go here. There's a ton of vendors. A ton of Black Series. They got all the Black Series figures there. From the first wave to up to date till now. They have all the freaking Marvel Legends you can think of there. I took pictures. I'll try to upload them so you guys can see them. Um, but yeah, I also got this Iron Fist here. I got him on the way home from the show at a GameStop for twelve ninety seven, so like thirteen something with tax. And at the toy show, they had this guy for twenty five dollars. I saw him. I was like, oh, that guy's so cool, man. But twenty five, I was like, nah. I already spent all the money on this these guys right here. But on the way home, I, you know, at a GameStop, 
we decided to stop and I thank God I waited and held out because I got him real cheap from twelve ninety five man. Not bad. So yeah guys, um it was fun. Uh, just me and my, my uncle went. Um my dad was gonna go, my friend from work was gonna go, my cousin Benjamin was gonna go, but at the last minute, you know, my cousin Benjamin, he gets sick, he gets a cold. My friend from work, he he doesn't wake up in time. We left him behind, which was sad. Um, we have a set time to leave here from Fresno at five, and he didn't wake up in time, so we had we left. I mean, my dad, he couldn't make it. He had some things to do, and my brother went, so. It was pretty neat. Um, I also got to meet a YouTuber that was there. And um, a lot of you might know him by Shardimus Prime. Yeah, I met him there. Got to, got to take a picture with him. Got to meet him. He's a really cool guy. Real down to earth. He's funny though. Um, yeah, I mean, it was fun meeting Shardimus Prime there. Um, I have a picture on my phone. I'll try to just stick it in on the video at the end if I can. I mean, it's, I'm new to YouTube, so I don't know how to do all this stuff. Um... I'll see what I can do. I think I can put it at the end of the video so you guys can see it. It's really cool meeting him there. Got to talk to him for a little bit and really neat. Um, yeah, guys. Um, sorry I haven't posted a video in a while. I know I told you I was gonna post some X Men figures that I got. Um, I'll still do that. A lot of they're all open now, so I'll just show you guys. You know, maybe a collection update. On what I have on Legends now. Because I have quite a bit now. I mean I've been buying them a lot. So it's not a big big collection. But from what I first showed you guys what I had. Till now. I mean it's it's grown pretty big. Over the course of what I think two weeks. So. But yeah. Um, thanks for watching. Please like. And leave a comment. And if you want to see more content. Of what I buy. At toy shows or if I go hunting. I You know I go hunting. I come home. Show you guys what I got. Um, let me know if you guys want more. Please subscribe. And um, thank you for watching.